Good evening, everybody. This is Frost Paper Board Time with you here. It's 11 23 p.m. on Tuesday, August 31st, 2021. My last video of the month. This one, this first one is going to be a recipe from the good I got from a Gooseberry Patch website just yesterday. This one is pork and peach kebabs from the recipe cook it book called Cook It Quick, their cookbook, one of Gooseberry Patch's cookbook. Now, this was sent in by Ed Smolsky from Lyons, Illinois. And Gooseberry Patch and myself would like to thank him for sending in that recipe. Such a good pick. Now, what you need for this are two peaches halved, pitted, and cut into six wedges. You can remove the pit with a knife. Just tap it like that, and the pit will come out. Once we're in cut into six wedges, one half pounds of pork tenderloin, cut into about 18 to 20 cubes, six skewers, now you can use metal or bamboo skewers, that part is up to you. Three quarts of a cup of honey barbecue sauce. I think the combination of the peach, the pork, and the honey on this one, it's a good combination. Of course, you can serve it with cooked brown rice, but you don't have to. But I suggest that you do, it would be nice just to give it, just so it could soak up the flavors of the flavors of the sauce. That would be a nice thing to have, wouldn't it? Of course it would. Then you cut the peach and onion wedges crosswise in half, thread the peach, onion, pork pieces alternatively onto the skewers. It, Remember, in that order, it's peach, then it's onion, and then pork. But you can do it any way you'd like. You have to leave some space in between for the grilling, for even grilling. Because if it's too close together, they won't grill very well, or they'll burn. So you might want to be, so you've got to be extra careful. Right? Okay. Then grill skewers over medium-high heat. For about 15 minutes or until the pork juices run clear, turning skewers occasionally, brush your barbecue sauce for the last five minutes. Serve with cooked rice, that's if you desire to do so. And this one makes six servings. So, looking for a tasty way to grill a favorite? Then these pork and peach kebabs are definitely your ticket, or your one way ticket to that flavor town. So give this one a try. So, again, a big thank you to Ed Smolsky from Lyons, Illinois, and the Gooseberry Patch for giving us this recipe. I got another peach recipe coming up, so stay tuned and don't go away.